The Vanguard Award is presented to an individual or group whose groundbreaking work increases our understanding and awareness of racial and social issues. Here to present the Vanguard Award, please welcome two people I work with and I love, Mr. Blair Underwood and Sanaa Lathan. Now, this man doesn't rap, he doesn't sing, he doesn't dance, but my longtime friend, Brother Russell Simmons, is one of the most important pioneers in the history of hip hop. In his 30 year career, this wildly successful mogul has taken b boying, DJing, MCing, and graffiti from the South Bronx to South Africa. He's a visionary who changed the game. Russell fought in the trenches for my generation to have our own voice. And in 2009, he continues to fight for social and political responsibility. Oh, hold up, before we get started, I want everybody to know my name is Russell Rush, and I come to play the cold rock stuff. Russell Simmons single-handedly spearheaded hip-hop's transformation from street novelty to international phenomena. Simmons gained fame by managing the early careers of Curtis Blow, Run DMC, DJ Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince. Then he and his partner Rick Rubin founded Def Jam Records, revolutionizing the art form and creating a generation of rap superstars. Slick Rick, Run DMC, The Beastie Boys, LL Cool J, Jay-Z, Ludacris, Public Enemy, and Foxy Brown, to name a few. But an ambitious visionary like Russell knew rap was about more than music, so he took it to the movies with Nutty Professor. He led rap's successful boogie down to Wall Street with ventures like Fat Farm, Baby Fat, and Argyle Culture Clothing. He partnered with director Stan Lathan and formed Simmons Lathan Media, creating groundbreaking TV programs like HBO's Deaf Comedy Jam. Anybody here from the South? Yeah, yeah, me too, me too, South Central Los Angeles. Image award-winning Deaf Poetry Jam and MTV's Runs House. A master marketer, Russell's current internet venture, Global Grind, presents the world through the lens of hip-hop culture. In his latest incarnation, this hard-working yoga enthusiast and vegan has become an ambassador for black culture and youth worldwide. The Hip Hop Summit Action Network educates young people on the issues of economic empowerment, voter education, and social advocacy. The Rush Philanthropic Arts Foundation exposes disadvantaged young people to arts taken out of schools. Russell promotes interfaith and ethnic dialogue around the world by working with Rabbi Mark Schneier as chairman of the Foundation for Ethnic Understanding. His Diamond Empowerment Fund is raising money for education programs in African diamond producing nations. Whether he's campaigning for President Obama or launching another successful venture, Russell Simmons continues to inspire creative expression and social activism throughout the world. It's no secret that Russell Simmons is, is an advocate for rappers and griots. To celebrate his life and words, please welcome deaf poets Ben Al Swag, Joshua Bennett, and George Watsky. You are our vanguard. Uniforms, black suit with hip hop accents, fitted with a New York Yankees cap, more than a movement, more than a force. We call him the Godfather. Because, because before you came, we were silent. From the poets who pen before us to those who are not granted this privilege. DJ scratching turntables on their chins, MCs trading punchlines in alleyways. Anything, Anything just to get a hit. See, most of our leaders left, so we had to write with our right and left just to write the wrongs they left. Check. Like kings in danger during chess. But you showed us that in this game, black can make the first move. What do you call a man who spun the brakes to make tradition and then penned a bestseller posted in the downward dog position? A flexible thinker. Vanguard? No. How about global, no pork vocal, New York local, loco, mocha, yoga mogul? <laughs> yoga mogul. <laughs> We're going with Vanguard. 
Vanguard. Vanguard. Like leading the troops, like we were traveling griots with broken guitar strings, couldn't follow the top music, so we danced like machine guns and called it popping. And you once said, art allows people to dream their way out of struggle. So thank you for giving us music that fed our souls and defined a generation. For transforming barren city blocks into beautiful Broadway plays. We're hanging on nothing but billboards now. Finally figured out how to defy gravity and truly be fly. Using boomboxes like wings, listening to rock the bells, because we can never afford to rock bling. So from high top Nikes to Adidas with no strings. You built a summit for the music. You signed the blueprint and then brought stillness to the movement. If you are the peak and what rushes you've made, we don't live in your shadow, we grow in your shade. Who else could fuse fashion and freestyle? Flip our style to Argyle. All as a means of accomplishing our dreams. So thank you for rope chains and baby fat models. <laughs> The Beastie Boys for finally giving hope to thin limbed schlamazels. From the projects to the front office, and, and Ronald, Ronald Reagan to, to Barack Obama. Your vision has paved the way for change, to use throats like megaphones and finally let this world know our names. So now we scream our words from the lines of the page so that deaf poetry no longer falls on deaf ears. Mr. Simmons, thank you for the stage.